There's nothing better than a freshly squeezed glass of OJ, but it's been pretty pricey to get your hands on America's favorite juice. I would say nationwide the consumer should be concerned. The cost of orange juice in the U.S. skyrocketing this year to more than $4 a pound. And while the futures price has come back a little bit, it's still historically high. All of it thanks to Mother Nature. This year's orange crop got hammered by a combination of both disease and bad weather. Tonight, Florida has been rocked back on its heels. Towards the end of 2022, Hurricane Ian and Hurricane Nicole ran roughshod through Florida. Critical farms flooding and oranges dropping from trees. Why is your orange juice so expensive? Because we are running out with our number one quality fruit. Robert and Lisa Marie Roth own Bob Roth's New River Groves. It's a major citrus grove in Florida that's been squeezing out oranges since 1964. They say their farm is dealing with another sticky situation, the incurable infection of citrus greening spreading rapidly across the orange crop. The greening will, will destroy the fruit, destroy the trees. You can't sell the fruit. If they don't find uh, satisfactory remedies to all these diseases, uh, it could possibly go under completely. Their once flourishing farm has taken a major blow. They say that they've lost about 50% of their orange groves in just the last 15 years. I've kind of adjusted to the fact that it's going downhill and it's going out. The business now forced to shift gears, focusing on agritourism and planting things like mango trees. And they're hardly alone. Florida as a whole took a major hit as the biggest supplier of oranges in the country. The forecast for orange production in the state this season more than halved from just two seasons ago. That according to the USDA. And the bottom line, that could mean orange juice will continue to squeeze your wallet. Every time there's uh, something else that happens in the state of Florida, the prices go up because uh, there's less fruit. But Lisa Marie trying to see the bright side. You never know what's going to happen. I'd like to be optimistic about it, that we will get a change in the fruit and that we will have citrus to ship all over the country for our customers. Sam Brock, NBC News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.